All right, should I start? What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Hyper Change. Today we're doing another Moonshot Monday. We're gonna talk about my favorite company in the whole world, Tesla, and a potential partnership with Uber. The Tesla Uber self-driving partnership, or maybe rivalry, I don't know, we're gonna figure out what to call it later, has been unfolding for quite some time now. So July 2015, really interesting piece of news comes out. Steve Jervison, incredibly highly regarded Silicon Valley venture capitalist, also a Tesla board member, says that he was at a dinner where the Uber CEO, Travis Kalaknik, made a statement saying he would buy half a million self-driving Teslas if they could build them by 2020 and deploy them as his robot fleet of taxis. Later in July, on the Tesla earnings call, Adam Jonas, the Morgan Stanley analyst who covers the company, brought up the article on the conference call and said, hey, look, Elon, Travis said he would buy half a million self-driving Model 3s from you if you could build them. Would you do this? And if you would, why wouldn't you just consider building your own mobility software platform, basically cutting out Uber as the middleman? Before Jonas can even finish saying, you don't have to answer that, Musk said, I don't think I'm gonna answer that. If Elon Musk realizes that Uber CEO is just gonna buy all the Teslas and redeploy them with software, he might as well just do that himself. Then, everything stays quiet for a year, Elon Musk releases Master Plan Part 2. In this Master Plan Part 2, Elon reveals that Tesla is going to launch something called the Tesla Network. This is going to allow your Tesla to drive itself and act as a taxi without you doing anything and make money. Okay, so now Pandora's box is open and it's like, Tesla is going to go head to head with Uber. They're going to launch their own competitor that does exactly what Uber does. It's going to be an app you can interface with. They're only going to be Teslas. All of them are going to be robots. If I was Uber, I would be freaking out about this. So the craziest part of the new autopilot website is that there was a note at just the very bottom that said you cannot use your autopilot software to monetize your Tesla, aka put it on Uber or Lyft as a robo taxi. So they are directly saying that you cannot do that. And it says, but you will be able to rent it out for monetization on the Tesla network, details of which will be unveiled next year. The company's got earnings coming up this Wednesday, which is when they're gonna lay out their vision for the next year. I think we're gonna get more color and granularity on exactly what the Tesla network is, when we can expect it to roll out, how it's gonna look in terms of whether it's partnered with some other ride-sharing company or it's 100% vertically integrated with its own product. Funniest part of all of this is Uber is valued at 62 and a half billion as of their last funding round six months ago. Tesla trades on the stock market for 50 billion. So all in all, Tesla's trading for less than Uber, even though they might displace Uber with this one product that's actually better. So when you think about the discrepancy in valuation, it makes you think, okay, either Uber's way overvalued or Tesla's way undervalued. Either way, there's something really exciting going on here. And if Tesla launches this Tesla network, not only is it gonna be a huge boost for revenue potentially, but it's also gonna be an incredible incentive for people to buy Teslas themselves because they can start renting it out. It fundamentally changes the economics of what the transportation industry looks like. Having a platform where you can just tap and rent out your car and have it autonomously become a taxi and create revenue for you will flip the entire economics of the automobile industry on its head, going from a buy a single car model to a pay Tesla monthly fee to be part of the Tesla network and get around everywhere sustainably. So that's it, Moonshot Monday. Uh, I either want to pitch that Uber should desperately partner with Tesla ASAP or Tesla should just step its floor on the gas, launch the Tesla network, give Kalaknik the middle finger and be on its way. Anyway, that's another episode of Moonshot Monday. Stay tuned. We're coming back next week with something real exciting. Oh my god. Mwah. Dude, this is a 10 out of 10 carbonara, bro. Mm. Who would have ever thought that the taxi business would be this sexy? I didn't.